Hey, what's up here? Vic here with Search Triggers. I'm going to show you this is a landing page. Uh, many of you are buying traffic and sending it to a landing page. In this video, I'm going to show you a new strategy that is amazing. What you can do is like this is a traditional landing page. So you're opting into your landing page. And inside of the landing page, you're you basically have a follow-up email. Like this email, like when, once you opt into a landing page, it's going to uh, like show you exactly what kind of website traffic you can get. <laughs> okay, so this is what we do. Now with search triggers, you can actually target keywords in your PPC or paid per click campaigns and then drive that traffic to a blog post. And the blog post itself will have a popover. I'm going to show you in this next video exactly how you can do that um, using search triggers and some of the techniques and strategies for tagging your videos uh, in here. So now here you can see um, this is a, a, a process that we're going through just to go ahead and get set up with search triggers. So without any further ado, this is, our, our, this is my blog that I'm going to be showing you. And right in here, very quickly, you can design the type of blog post um, popover. Uh, here I'm using AWeber uh, to be able to show you exactly what's going to do that. We're going to go into the detail into this in the whole video. I'm just giving you a little quick preview. This is a pop over. So when I send my traffic, it goes right to the pop over landing page. What that also does with search triggers, it gives you the, the, the keyword juice. You see these tags over here on the, on the side? Those tags, we generated those tags using search triggers so that when we buy the traffic, it goes to a landing page. The landing page still opts people in. But check this out. When we look at the most recent traffic that we sent, like from the Yahoo Bing network, instead of sending it to just a capture page, we're sending it to a blog. This is a capture page. That's the old way we used to do things, to send people right to a capture page. The new way is we're sending people directly to an opt-in offer on the blog post itself. And the blog post itself starts building recurring free traffic so you still are getting your leads. However, you're also now getting additional traffic uh, from natural search results that will build over time. And so I'm going to show you exactly how we can do that with search triggers. So this is a, just a little quick overview on the many things you can do with search triggers. We designed it as the ultimate keyword research tool to help you not only do uh, SEO, but also your PPC, and also track your statistics and your blogs in one place. <clears throat> this is my blog, uh, Video Blogging Hacks to Grow Your Business. And I would like to make a request. If you're watching this video on YouTube, it's part of a much larger video. Uh, the exact how-to is on my blog, and I'm going to put the link right below in this video. You can click that link and go watch the exact how-to step-by-step stuff um, that I recorded earlier this morning. It's about 30 minutes that will take you step by step on how to do this for yourself. But right now I just want you to understand one tip from this page. Make your videos longer than five minutes. If you do that, you can get natural search results in big Google search, big Google search, not just YouTube. In other words, if you can, like this video, if you could watch it for more than five minutes, the longer you watch my videos, the, the more you're letting YouTube know, hey, what Vic is talking about is relevant. It's very important. I like it. I like what you're doing. I like what you're saying. I like how you're approaching this thing. So please make your videos longer than five minutes and do whatever it takes to encourage people to watch them for more than five minutes. The longer, the better. Google doesn't really want to have short videos anymore. They want to have some really depth, in-depth, detailed content that provides lots of value and engagement for folks. So on that note, um, go ahead and click the link below this video and check out the blog post where I have the entire 30 minute video. Next thing I want you to do is go to searchtriggers.com and go create a free account. This free account is um, IP address tagged so you can create a username and a password. We actually give you a free trial to the full version of search triggers, all the bells and whistles 
that our paying subscribers enjoy. However, you get to test it, test drive this thing for free. And we also give you ways like of, of, of strategies. We're doing a weekly hangouts with this, uh, this tool every, um, every week uh, to uh, develop it. And you're part of our early adopter family. We have thousands of people who are starting to use this tool. We believe this is the like a breakthrough tool. So all you need to do is put in your username, your email address. That's my uh, personal email address. If you have a list, feel free to opt me into your list. I'm totally okay with that. Put in your desired password. And um, as you're typing in your password, make sure you remember it's something simple. Now, Search Triggers also runs in a tablet. So if you um, are using a tablet, you can also use a five-digit security pin so you can access your Search Triggers account. Because because like if you're using a tablet or a phone, it's very difficult to use like a shift key or using some sort of complex password. You will need to use passwords for any kind of purchases or buying points or subscriptions or anything like that for Search Triggers. Uh, we've made our pricing model competitive with all the other keyword tools out there. And we believe we also have the best free keyword tool out there that is advertising supported. So go ahead and sign up. And obviously, I already exist in the database. Uh, so <clears throat> there's no need uh, for me to register again. So thank you for watching uh, this little introduction. I'm going to now go back to the um, uh, other video that I made earlier this morning. Uh, the audio was a little bit distorted. So I'm actually going to re-record the audio here uh, in, in just a moment. Uh, if you want to see the original video with the audio, go ahead and click the link below and check out the blog post uh, with the entire training. Um, and, and as soon as possible, I'm going to go ahead and make another training uh, where the audio was not distorted. And, you know, it's, it, it's, here's a tip for you. If you're making videos, make sure you run a little test on your webcam to make sure that you don't have the, the, the volume so high. So on that note, um, I will see you in the next video. Thank you for uh, you know joining us here. I really would love to you know uh, to to just get your feedback. Like write some comments about you know what you th what was your experience with search triggers. We also have a, I'm putting in the link to our blog. You can go and check out our blog. There's lots of articles we've written for you and additional trainings uh, in how to use the tool step by step. So. On that note, please go to searchtriggers.com, go ahead and register, and we'll bring you back to the um, next training. Now we're only going to be looking inside of YouTube. We're not going to be looking for the whole web, so that we're going to have some different numbers. Let's see how many videos are out there. Wow, <laughs> there's a lot. Okay, website traffic has 67,000 YouTube videos. 67,000 YouTube videos. Now, if I wanted to see them, um, I can click, if I want to click on Google, you just click on the little bar right here. It opens up a Google search. And uh, you can see here is all the, get tons of free traffic to your website in four hours. And you, know, you can see all the YouTube videos. So everything is inside of one place. Uh, if I want to see the difference between, uh, let's just go by sort by pages, okay? Okay, website traffic has 67,000. Now, you know what I find is really fascinating is that uh, Bing and Google rarely agree on anything. It's kind of funny. It's like <clears throat> when you look for um, website traffic in Google, it says analysis, report, checker, analytics, counter, and comparison. Uh, whereas Bing gives you a lot more spread of different like traffic, your site. Uh, increase web traffic. I like that one. Okay, let's just 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 go and let's say I want to create a long tail blog post or uh, a title in YouTube. So I just click increase web traffic. I'm just going to run that again. Let's see if we can get some more details on it. Yeah, <clears throat> a little bit more details on it. Okay, increase web tra website traffic. Now let's see. Everything is yellow. This is actually pretty cool. Uh, so let's go in here and see where we have. Okay, so again, increase traffic. Google, WordPress review. Uh, let's go in here. I don't know. Let's just run some numbers. Let's see if uh, let's see if we uh, might as well analyze the traffic and spend a little money here, uh, shall we? All right. Let's go ahead and analyze the traffic. Let's take a look and see what we have here. Remember, right now we're only looking at the competition. We're looking at the competition. We have a pretty good kind of a niche. Uh, we're working on increasing our web traffic. And it's rare in alignment. All my existing ads will work just fine. 
I remember I showed you earlier um, that we have over 1,800 keywords, I think, right now, um, that we're targeting for internet traffic. Uh, so as soon as that, okay, so increase web traffic software. <laughs> wow, look at that. There, as an exact match, four people last month looked for exactly, in other words, four people last month put in quotes increase traffic software, increase web traffic free. It's a great, great title for a blog post. Why? Well, because you want some exact match. I mean, the way you determine this stuff is you're going to start ranking under multiple words. Okay. Um, let's go see what had the most traffic. Increase website traffic with 13,000 visitors last month. Only 15,000 pages to compete with. Very small. Uh, comparatively, 30,000 ad impressions. Uh, CPC thirty two cents average bid value dollar ten. It tells you all the data that we need right here in our fingertips, guys. For eighty eight dollars, I could buy a traffic <laughs> last month and dominate the keyword we increase website traffic. So I'm just going to do that. Why not? Let's just grab all these, grab all these keywords, pop them in over here. Uh, go back to my Bing ads. Uh, let's see. Um, Okay, we'll just cancel out of that and we'll just add some more keywords. And as you can see, it's already inexact. We just add all the keywords right in here. Boom. All right, so now we have all that in there and we're just going to hit save. And we already had web traffic and website traffic, so we could just cancel out of those. So I just added more keywords. So what, what's really cool about this is that we have... Uh, now 1,822 keywords that we can target with our traffic. As soon as we unpause this campaign and we're sending traffic to our new landing page, our landing page, remember, instead of it being a traditional landing page, it's a blog post. Okay, so um, this was the one that we did. I changed it from 40%. Uh, get rid of how to get a good click-through rate on your offers in your email. And I'm just going to click view post. And voila, look what happens. As soon as someone visits here, they get uh, an opt-in box and they can just uh, close it out. And guess what? I already got the click. The click went to my offer, but I got Google Juice in addition to. And all those tags get seen by Google. So that's, that's, uh, that's what I wanted to share with you. Let me know in the comments how you like this, what you thought of it, uh, if this could be a benefit to you. Um, I really appreciate your time. I hope you learned something today. And uh, please be sure to uh, use search triggers uh, in conjunction with your paid uh, uh, media strategy. Take care, and I'll see you in the next video.